Have you ever dreamed of financial freedom, of not having to worry about making ends meet or living paycheck to paycheck? Do you know the key steps to achieve it? Financial freedom is the ultimate goal for many of us. It's the key to living a fulfilling life, free from the stress and anxiety that comes with financial struggles. Join me as I show you the three simple steps to achieving financial freedom. Hello and welcome. Welcome back to Empower and Thrive. Today, we're diving into a topic that can change your life. Three simple steps to financial freedom. Whether you're just starting your financial journey or looking to improve your money management, these steps are easy to follow and incredibly effective. Let's get started. One of the biggest challenges people face in achieving financial freedom is debt. Whether it's credit card debt, student loans, or a mortgage, having a significant amount of debt can make it difficult to make progress towards your financial goals. Another challenge is the lack of savings. Without a safety net, unexpected expenses can quickly derail your finances. And finally, living paycheck to paycheck can make it impossible to get ahead financially. You're stuck in a cycle of living from one paycheck to the next, with no room to save or invest for the future. This cycle can be overwhelming, and it's easy to feel like you're stuck in it forever. But the truth is, achieving financial freedom is possible, and it all starts with making a few simple changes to your financial habits. So, what are the three simple steps to achieving financial freedom? The first step is saving. This means setting aside a portion of your income each month and building a safety net to fall back on in case of unexpected expenses. If you don't have any savings, the first step is to create an emergency fund. Life is full of surprises and not all of them are pleasant. An emergency fund protects you from unexpected expenses like medical bills, car repairs, or job loss. One of the most crucial elements of financial freedom is having a safety net and that comes in the form of an emergency fund. Get three to six months of living expenses or at least $1,000 in a savings account and keep it there for emergencies. Like actual emergencies, not an, oh, this is on sale now emergency. If you don't have that and don't know where to get started, check out my video on the 52 week savings challenge. That will help you get over $1,300 into an emergency fund and help you build good savings habits. The second step is manage and eliminate debt. Debt can be a major roadblock to financial freedom, but with a solid plan, you can manage and eliminate it effectively. Overwhelmed with debt and don't know where to start? List all your debts along with their interest rates. Focus on paying off high interest debts first, as they cost you the most over time. Eliminating high interest debt should be your top priority because it can quickly spiral out of control and cost you significantly more over time. High interest debts, like credit card balances, accumulate interest rapidly, making it harder to pay off the principal. By tackling these debts first, you reduce the overall amount you'll pay in interest, freeing up more money to save and invest in your future. Having a clear debt repayment strategy is crucial. There are different ones out there, so do some research and find out what fits best for your budget. Here are a couple popular strategies to consider. The snowball method, where you pay off the smallest debt first, gives you quick wins and keeps you motivated. Alternatively, the avalanche method focuses on paying off the debt with the highest interest rate first, ultimately saving you more money in the long run. Choosing the right strategy helps you stay organized and committed to becoming debt-free. Consider consolidating your debts into a single loan with a lower interest rate. This can simplify your payments and reduce the overall interest you pay, making it easier to manage your finances. Additionally, don't hesitate to negotiate with creditors for better terms. You'd be surprised how often lenders are willing to lower interest rates or waive fees if you communicate openly about your situation. Taking these proactive steps can significantly accelerate your journey to financial freedom. Finally, let's talk about making smart lifestyle choices. 
Your daily decisions greatly impact your financial health, so it's crucial to develop habits that support your goals. Making smart lifestyle choices is crucial because poor decisions can quickly undo all the progress you've made with saving and budgeting. Without mindful spending and disciplined financial habits, even the best savings plans can be derailed, leaving you back at square one. However, by embracing these smart lifestyle choices and incorporating them into your daily routine, you can overcome these challenges and steadily move toward financial independence. Let's explore what you can do to help you make good choices. First, live within your means. Resist the temptation to increase spending as your income grows. Instead, prioritize saving and investing the extra money to build wealth rather than just spending it. If you get a raise, and let's say get an extra $100 per paycheck, don't adjust your lifestyle. Instead, take that $100 and save it while living at the same level you were before your raise. Practice mindful spending. Before making a purchase, ask yourself if it aligns with your long-term goals and values. This simple shift in mindset can lead to substantial savings over time. Be intentional with your purchases by prioritizing what truly matters to you and cutting down on impulsive buys. Don't buy into trends. Skip the latest gadget, beauty product, or latest trendy cup. All these small, intentional choices to skip these purchases can lead to substantial savings over time. By making these smart lifestyle choices, you improve your financial situation and enhance your overall quality of life. Financial freedom is just as much about staying in the savings mindset and building good habits as it is about attaining certain numbers. By following these three steps, you can break free from the cycle of living paycheck to paycheck and start building a brighter financial future. You'll be able to enjoy the freedom and security that comes with knowing you have a safety net and that you're working towards a more secure financial future. So, what are the three key steps to achieving financial freedom? Save, pay off debt, and make good lifestyle choices. It's that simple. By following these three simple steps, you can take control of your finances and start building a more secure financial future. If you're ready to start taking control of your finances and achieving financial freedom, be sure to check out more financial tips on my channel. And if you've already started working towards financial freedom, share your experiences in the comments section below. Until next time, keep thriving.